I don't wonder why we're in here. Oh, she won't. Surprised he's fucking food sitting on the counter. Didn't bring the fucking <laughs> candles. Okay. Do you want me to go grab it real quick? I can grab a lighter real quick. We can light them once we get them out there. Can you carry one of these? Yep. Once you open the door. for lunch and here oh might need a Go grab her. Say puppies, puppies. Oh shoot! Are you gonna say? Are you gonna? Are you gonna sing happy birthday too? I know. I know. Okay, I'm gonna go get her. Miss Carolina, hey. will you come here? to you. Happy birthday, dear Carolina. Happy birthday to you. Nice high pitch, mom. That was great. That was great. All right, make a wish. Make a wish, make a wish, make a wish, make a wish. Whoa. Well, now we know who's the one that's got all the hot air. Galena. Oh my god. My, my, my. Hey, can we sit here? Oh. Yeah, she thought we forgot. She thought we no. forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Aww, quesadilla so explosion salad. See, Ricky says, oh, Happy flowers. birthday, flowers Carolina. <laughs> Happy birthday. This is flowers from me and Lamar. This Thank is flowers you, for, so from the boys and Oh my gosh, it's my birthday is Sunday. Yay! Happy, oh. happy birthday. 33. <laughs> 33. You're getting old, Carolina. Come on, Nina. I'll be 35, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my gosh, thank you, thank you very much. Yay! Yay. Look at oh, this beautiful surprise. Yay! Yummy. Look at the cake. Mm. <gasps> it's, it's what cake? Me Tiramisu. Tiramisu. It's good. Mm. It's good cake. Tiramisu. I never eaten that one. Oh yes, very very good. What's your card say? Oh. oh quick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You gotta sing happy birthday. Yeah, just tell me happy birthday. They gotta sing happy birthday. Gotta sing happy birthday. What you say? Put put on your birthday face. face. Oh, that's pretty. Get, get <laughs> your birthday butt celebrating. Thank you very much. Look at me. <laughs> you got money. You got money. Thank you, Miss Teresa. Thank you. Yes, my good birthday. Yes, 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 oh my God. Yes. <laughs> so mm. happy. So happy. Thank you very much, guys. See, okay, see. Happy birthday, Carolina. Yeah, happy birthday, Carolina. Did you bring your happy oh, birthday, me? <gasps> see, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Oh my god, baby, kisses, 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 kisses
Mother's all about singing today, y'all. Oh, Seriously. <laughs> Thank you okay. very much. We're trying to unload palm trees. We got so much going on around here today. So, hey, peeps! <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of all over the place. Right? Sorry. Oh, okay. We were trying so, to be secretive. Happy birthday, Carolina. We love Carolina. Been with Thank us. Thank you. This year, nine years this year. Nine, Mr. Elsa. Nine years this I year. I work for you 20, 23. Wow. You were 23. Yeah. Yeah. 23. Nine years. 10 years. 10 years. You were 23. No, 23, yeah. but I'm coming 24, and you will remember my birthday? That's right. That's yeah. Right. Now, here he comes. <laughs> okay, so we got a cluster in here today. So, we got birthday going on. We got Rose Garden out front trying to get finished. We got palm trees that are arriving. We got so much going on around here today. I hope you guys can keep up with everything that's going on here today because today is a cluster. <laughs> so let's go. And here they are. They arrived with the big palm trees. Mom is adding four more to her backyard. Let's see how they're going to get these off. They're big. We can. Come on, boys. Better move. All right, well, while well, they're trying to figure out how to get those off, let's go see what else is going on around the ranch. What was that, mother? So the strongest one out of all of them is not even hot. Well, now he's got his hand on it. <laughs> he's stronger than any of them. I know he should be on like the wheelbarrow, honestly. Ow, ow. How many guys we got? One, two, three, four, five, seven guys. Way else. Oh God. Get it, boys, get it, boys, get it, boys. They probably came to work today not knowing that they were going to have to move palm trees. <laughs> oh, mother. You feisty, Tajai. What did you have in your protein shake, mother? I read my horoscope. Yeah? I'm supposed to have a knockdown drag out fight with somebody today. All right, Sergio will be the first one to go toe to toe with you on that one. That's what it says. <laughs> really? Yeah. I wonder what mine says. I don't know, but I'm like, oh, shit. Probably like, oh, you know, take the day off, go hang out with the kids, stay away from your mother. <laughs> yeah. That I'm supposed to have a knockdown drag out. Yeah, that is kind of.
All right, guys. I know this is probably not very interesting, but they already unloaded one. They just unloaded the second, and they have two more to go. So let's go. All right, here we have them taking part of the fence down to be able to get these palm trees. Hey, mom. Maja, where are you putting these palm trees? Right here. Put <laughs> that. What'd you say? <laughs> really? How do you lose weight? Huh? How do you lose weight? Drink beer? Maybe. No? No? Plus, I'm drinking. I'm a Plus, fat and food. He just drinks his dinner. All right, guys, sorry. We got sidetracked there. Let's see if I can get this fence apart. All right, back to where we were. Two on that end, two on this end. Oh, so right here in the same. Right. Okay. So we're going to add another one right here and then one over here. And oh. the same thing on that end. Okay. So we'll end up with seven palm trees across here instead of just three. That'll be pretty. What, okay. So what made you decide to do this? I wanted more palm trees. Okay. I guess that's a good, good enough reason, huh? You know me and palm trees. I love palm trees. And if I can't live in California, I just have to bring California here. But I can't do a queen's palm because in Texas, queen's palms die all the time because we always ha end up having a freeze and queens are so fragile that they always die. So these Mexican fan palms are the sturdiest and most. They're big. Yeah. Big, big, big. So we're just doing more palm trees so we can have it more, look more like All California. right, look at them. They getting a workout in today. It's very muggy today. Why is that? Oh, I know, but I love it. It's like you come outside, you start sweating, you lose weight. It's a good detox. Uh oh. Would you like to go over there and help them? Show them up. Yeah, you could. Put my muscle in. You'd be like, boys, Which ones are the taller aside. ones? I think it's the same. This, this one looks like it's the tallest. That looks short. Okay. They want to put they're, they're not all the same. You want to put that one this side? Yes. Right there? Yes. Okay. Right here. I don't know. Or right there. I don't know. I, I, okay, I'm going to put it right there. I don't know which ones are taller. I'm over here. When, when I'm planting, you tell me where to yeah. go. I'm going to put it right here now. Yeah, yeah. Just pile them all. One will go up there and two right here. That one, I'm going to put it to him. Yeah. I just don't know which ones are taller. Yeah. All right, y'all. Mom was not lying. It is a crazy, crazy, busy day. Now we got the electricians pulling up, but can't get in the back because the trailer with the palm trees is parked there. So, but that's a good spot. You know, there you go. Got a Chevy and GMC sitting next to each other. <laughs> so, Mom, what are the electricians here today for? I just kind of said that ass backwards. Sorry, guys. In the back for the zip line, add electrical box for the uh, go-kart and the, you know, electrical shit. <laughs> Oh, you're stumbling over your words today, too. I just said something asked backwards a minute too, ago. Too many people here. Too much going on again today. You know. So, it goes on this end. You're going to lay two of them here. Lay two of them here. That one's going to go there. And then one more. I, know, I got to know which ones are taller, but the taller one comes down here. Where's Ricky Rue? It's Ricky Rue with Carolina. We'll go see how she's liking her salad. Carolina.
Gina. Yes. Hola. Um, see, look, there's Ricky Boo. Ricky Boo. Uh -huh. Ricky. Hi. Are you hanging out with Carolina on her birthday? You stay with me all the time for eating my lunch. Hi, Ricky Boo. How was your salad? That's good, Nina. Good? Perfect. Perfecto. Mm -hmm. Now you just need a, a cerveza. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> So now my electricians are here and they are getting ready to put electricity on this wall, fence, whatever you want to call it, um, so that I can plug in my golf cart and my dune buggy so that we have power out here. Do I, am I going to need light out here? No, I got lights right here. Got, well, yeah, yeah. No, okay. That's right. I that's right. Day. That's right. Okay. So, yeah, we're doing all fun kinds of fun stuff. We got so many people here today. Good Lord. Good Lord. And then we're adding another light out there. They're unloading the palm trees. It's just never ending. Never ending. They're busy with the flower beds. So they're doing... 12 hollies around the middle and 16 baby rose bushes around the edges. So they are busy doing this. They're doing the edging. Then they have to do the mulch. So this is gonna turn out so incredibly nice when it's done. So they're working on that. It's looking good, it's looking good, it's looking good. There's my neighbor, Laura, over there, taking care of her horses. So pretty, yeah. And then over here, they are working on the rose beds at the top of the pond. And this is gonna look so incredibly good. So, Sergio's guys got done making the wood um, beds and now the landscapers are busy placing the rose bushes it is just going to look so incredibly good so they've got to paint the very front one but they're busy placing rose bushes to see if we're gonna have enough. I think they brought in 99 of them today. But this is gonna make the front, I call it the front, some people might call it the back, but the front of the pond when you drive in now is just gonna look so incredibly beautiful, especially when they all turn red and bloom. So exciting! Okay, this is starting to look so good. Oh my gosh. So, they're gonna have to paint it, but it's looking so incredibly good. And I think they've got almost all of them planted. So now they've gotta bring in all of the mulch and get it mulched so it looks all pretty. Oh my gosh, looks so good. And there's Carolina with the twins. Somebody stole my car. Somebody stole my car. Yes, I did. Oh. Uh, I got there in five minutes. I need to report a theft. Somebody stole my car. Anyways, looking good, looking good. Okay, so I think they're bringing in the mulch this afternoon to get that finished. And then they're going to be mulching these three flower beds over here also because they've gotten I think most of the edging put in so and then next week my landscape other guy Simone will be putting the landscaping lights in so that'll look all so pretty so yay it's all coming together installing the 
automatic chicken coop door. Look at him. Say, like, we're excited. Hay que limpiarse los monti. Chickens are real spoiled now. They're what? Real spoiled. Well, I figured that would help also. Right. Like if, say, we're gone for the evening, at least the damn door will shut. Right. Or say we all are sleeping in one day, I don't feel bad that they're just sitting out here locked in their damn chicken coop, you know. All right, there is the new automatic door. Got an electric door. Yeah. Two already went in. Got your electric door, Waiting guys. for the third one. She's a little skeptical here. What is that? Got an electric door for you. How cool is that? Yeah. I'm like, okay, what is this? Check it out. That's your new door. Usually <laughs> by 8.30, for sure they're inside. Yeah, it just depends. It might just wait on like the last one, but it's like 8.30, 8 8.45 now just with how dark it stays. Maybe we should have made it 8.45. But well, you can always change it. I know. But by 8.30, it just depends on like, like tonight, it's probably going to be a lot darker come 8.30. Well, I know, but I just don't want it. Maybe I should Hello. Make it to be on the safe side. Hello. Should we change it to 8.45 just to be on the safe side? What do you guys think she's doing? Is she playing on her phone? Playing. <laughs> yeah, playing. When do I play on my phone? What are you doing, mother? Oh, work. Work, 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 work. What's that mark on your head? You didn't have that before I went to go get the kids. Oh, my God. You guys, see, I cannot leave my mother by herself. Okay. Before you even say anything. What the hell did you do? <laughs> oh my god, you guys. Got hurt. I was outside trying to tell them how to unload the trees. Because they were clear over here. And then they were having to unload and come all the way across. And just, I said, no. Just unload over here. So then they brought the truck over here. But then they all they did was back up. So then they were like trying to back up and they almost ran into Mike the electrician. So he moved his truck and then they almost ran into your truck. And I was like, why are you backing up? Why don't you use all of that acreage back there to turn around and drive up to unload the trees right here? Cause we already took a section of the fence out. Right. So as he decides to pull forward, one of the leaves of the palm tree hit the ladder that Sergio and his guys had up because they were trying to hang the portiche thing. <laughs> ah! So when that leaf hit the ladder, the ladder came and everything came falling on top of me and <laughs> gashed me in the forehead. Oh my God. So basically what you're saying is every time I leave the house, I'm going to have to put a helmet on you. <laughs> God, seriously. <laughs> oh, we have the perfect helmet. <laughs> Come on. Oh, we might even have to get like one of those plastic masks that you can like <laughs> screw drive to the damn helmet that you could like, like flip the over. Basketball players or the football players wear? Well, no, it, it's like, it's almost like a welding helmet per se. Yeah, but the basketball players, the football players wear one over there. Yeah, some of them. Yeah. And so I'm going to. Yeah, because last time it was like the head. Yeah, shit. And then what was, oh, the time before was. Your hand. Cut on the hand on the popcorn machine. So, yeah. Well, y'all, guess what? Her birthday is coming up. I know what I'm going to get her. Give me a special helmet. Because <laughs> I'm special. I'm going to put Queen TR on special there. Special needs. <laughs> I already have my own hard hat. Oh, my. Oh, well, you should be wearing that. The hard hat? God. Yeah. Anyways, we need to get back outside because they are getting ready to plant palm trees and all this other stuff. Like, I, I think they're going to be here all day tomorrow. Yeah, but we should also talk about your event that you're going to tomorrow oh, night. Yes, so I have an event tomorrow night, guys. Um, a friend of mine is turning 69. I swear she doesn't even look like she's 49. She's Asian. She like she and she hangs out with everybody that's young. 
She's so cool. But anyways, she's turning 69 and her birthday party is called 69 or something like that. Like naughty 69, you know. No, you, I don't know, mom. Do, do please, it, please Tashina? explain. <laughs> do you get it, Tashina? Can you please explain, mother? <laughs> yes, I know what that means, mother. <laughs> anyways, it's a naughty party. It's a naughty birthday party. So oh, you'll fit you'll fit right in then. <laughs> I always do. <laughs> so, anyways, I was trying to find the invite. Uh, the invite says um, that you are supposed to dress naughty. Uh, so it's O M G or is it O? It's like O M G or is it old M G? It's a birthday party. So stepping into my 69th birthday like a boss, of course, with the high heels and everything. So cute. Oh, that is cute. But anyways, um, what to expect? Dress naughty or nice. However you define 69. Attire. Leather, lace, latex, or sexy or elegant. Well, I can go elegant to everywhere. So why not go naughty? So. You already have an outfit picked out, don't you? I can yes, see it in your eye. Yes, yes, oh, yes. You guys yes, just yes, got yes. like the so, devil eye going on uh, here. Yeah. <laughs> So, maybe before we go outside, we'll go down and look at this outfit I've put together. All right. Oh, remember, gosh. remember when I got those uh, tool tool skirts? Mm -hmm. It's going to involve one of those skirts. Oh lordy! So we're we're refreshing the spray tan stuff. I'm surprised so. it hasn't like sweat off today with I how know. humid it is. I know. So, anyways, what to expect? Dress naughty or nice, however you define sixty nine. Mom's going out there with a bang. That's mm -hmm. just total. Well, I figure instead of at my age wearing what I was going to wear for the top and what I was going to wear for the bottom, I might walk in looking like a prostitute. Yeah, that's okay. It's a party. That's fine. It's kind of like my, how it's kind of like how it's hanging out. Like I'm talking just plain old sexy laundry. I don't know. You'll have to show me. It's kind of like Halloween. Anybody can wear anything on Halloween, right? Yeah. Anybody can wear anything at a birthday party. But they party. might go, Tracy, you're too old to do that. Be like, well, it was a 69 party, right? <laughs> <laughs> I've asked Tashina to go with me. <laughs> she politely said no. Oh, we could be getting into some trouble. I've already got George, the driver, taking me. In. Oh, my favorite buddy. So you he can sells go sweet. with me. Lamar can be watching the twins. And you can go with me and get into some trouble. Sleep? <laughs> You're not going to sleep around Nira. Oh, no. Nira. Uh, yeah. Yeah. She, she's a hoot. She's and a hoot. Amanda. Oh, yeah. Those two together. Oh, yeah. Woo. So it's already a party with me, Amanda, and Nira. So yeah. It's going to be a wild night. That's why I've got a driver. Okay. Let's go look at this outfit. Let's go. It's a little too much. You know what I'm saying? You're like, oh. Oh, but it's like you can dress however you want. <laughs> So you should be able to dress however you want. Your birthday party is 69. Let's not say you did, Mom. So it's not flattering? No. Why? I don't know. It's just, I don't know. You ought to be happy that your 62-year-old mother, soon to be, can still wear something like this. No, like, get it. I ain't, I ain't shaming. She's going to want to borrow it from me. <laughs> what am I, I, then I'm just going to have to like stuff my, my bra area. My goodness. <laughs> Seriously. The back end's not good. I, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I think if I walked in like this to the party, I'd look like a hooker. So, yeah. let me show you how we are going to look, though. What did I do with it? Oh, it's right here. <laughs> Anyways, what we're going to do is we're going to wear this with these badass Gucci's. And I think I'm going to go get a whip. Oh, only you, mother. 
No. I actually think it's cute. And if I don't want to wear, I'm going to put more spray tan on. Could wear it down here. You know. That's cute. I wouldn't have this on. I'll just put some black panties on. This is with no spray tan. Um, so we're gonna. Are you gonna change it? No, we're not changing. Well, we were. So basically, it'll be this. Cute. With some spray tan on. That's like the perfect weather, too. It's not cold outside. What do you think? And I'll have a black whip. Don't you think it's the perfect 69? Oh, body, yeah. Body are nice. The shoes are perfect. Yeah, because let's see the shoes here. Gucci. Those are cute. Let's see the top. Get on my jewelry. Let's see the top. Tatas are out there. They look like super cute. I'll put some cute old sunglasses on. And I'll carry out a cute little black purse. My, oh, yeah. My hair will be nice and fluffy and curly. Got some great makeup on. Now you just need to get a whip. So, <laughs> gotta run to Cindy's tomorrow. Get me a black whip. I should have one in my arsenal of in your collection. stuff, but I don't, <laughs> that I know of. Maybe if I go dig, I'll find it. But anyways, I'm sure with this hairdo and everything, I, I, I still think it's cute. So there's your little bit of fashion for Friday. Yep. So guys, did you fall asleep? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> I'm meditating. Ooh. It's my alone time. I'm picturing a fountain behind me and that noise. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. It's just been one of those crazy days around here. Um, what do you think of the outfit? Thumbs up, thumbs down for tomorrow night. Regardless of whether you thumbs up or thumbs down, I'm wearing it. <laughs> so even if you don't like it, I'm wearing it. So uh, you guys will see the finished look because we will take pictures. Um, of course, it'll be all over Instagram and my stories, but we will flash it up uh, Monday in Monday's video just so you can see uh, how it looked with the finished look with hair and makeup and everything. So um, remember guys, there's still a Mother's Day sale going on at TeresaRomer.com. The bundles are all on sale, so get your mother or somebody you love, including yourself, uh, one of the bundles because they're 20% off. and. Uh, Make sure you jump over there to the vault. We're gonna go live this weekend uh, on Instagram and YouTube. So uh, hopefully we'll be gathering up some more vault members by that live that we're gonna be doing. Uh, it's gonna be fun and exciting, so stay tuned. So anyways, it is hotter than Haiti here today. It's like 90 degrees or more. I don't know why the twins aren't in the pool having fun. I would be, I should be, but I'm trying to preserve a tan for tomorrow night so a spray tan is working so anyways guys you hear the water you hear the fountain behind me <laughs> i'm visualizing i'm manifesting that fountain anyways guys um until monday have a safe weekend bye bye